Hey guys, um, I wanted to record another video talking about another project that I did, not in any way related to the musical I'm doing. Uh, back in 99, when I was 16, I wrote and recorded an album called Peace on Mars, and I did it under the name Arcanon Space Boy, who is kind of a Ziggy Stardust kind of character. And listening to it now, it is completely fucking ridiculous. And I, I told myself that I would never do anything Arcanon Space Boy related again. And then a couple of years ago, I found myself writing the follow-up album. And it's called The Alien of Today. And uh, it's, it's more of, of a straight rock and roll album, as opposed to the first one, which honestly, I don't know what the hell it was. Um, but this one is much more mature, I guess. And um, I was able to get out a lot of things that I was uh, e explaining a lot of experiences that I had had. And so now this year um that i finally have the band together we're we're gonna perform it live in its entirety and it'll be probably a two and a half hour show because we're going to do some other things too uh but i wanted to plug it any way that i could and i wanted to plug the cd any way that i any way that i can um so if you go to cdbaby.com it's available on there if you type in Arcan and Space Boy, or The Alien of Today, or maybe Sean Jessman will work, I don't know. But uh, you might like it, you might absolutely hate it, uh, but I had a lot of fun, um, not so much writing it, I had a lot of fun recording it. And I worked with a lot of cool people. Uh, Austin Regalia played guitar for me, uh, Chris Hadding, uh, Lee Romano produced it. And we had um, a lot of fun working together, and I hope to, to work with them again. But anyway, Arcanon Space Boy, the alien of today, and that's all that I have to say, I think, because I have a very bad habit of saying something the wrong way and having people think all kinds of weird and negative things about me. So I'm being more careful now. But anyway, uh, check it out and see what you think.